shadows way too long You always thought that you were weak But babe, you're wrong Yeah, you better step into the light Just give it a try Think that it's time you let that spark out You've been hiding in the shadows way too long and welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is tiffany beeson from beauty and the beesons and i upload every single tuesday and sunday you got more blanky fuzz on your face uh, we are officially at our bay house we do we had some hiccups we are gonna have to go home this evening to grab some stuff but our farmer's dog delivered to our house or and uh, obviously it's like Daddy. a cold thing so we need to switch that delivery to here but we're going back home at some point today um but we also just I want to give you like some updates. Mama, you are not talking. I'm not all done talking. <laughs> um, I want to give you some updates on the house. So we thought it was going to be completely finished this week, but um, some like appliances and stuff took a while to get in. So currently we're staying here. We don't have a washer and dryer yet. We don't have a kitchen sink with running water. There's actually no uh, faucet in there. So that makes things challenging. Uh, no oven, no microwave. It's kind of hard staying here with four kids. Hi, baby. Hi. But it's also like just so beautiful and we all, we love it, but we've been going to get coffee every morning because we don't have like filtered water for our coffee maker and things to wash dishes and stuff. So we've been getting coffee at Dunkin' every morning, which can't complain about that. I love their hot coffee. I love their iced coffee too. Um, and then we've been having to eat out for all meals and that's stressful just because like having to eat out for every meal with the kids but also it just I feel like ugh, gross there's a baby duck that's the thing so like all of those all of that being said Tanner there's a little baby duck out here huh yeah come see yeah all of that being said uh, we still love it here and we don't want to leave so we're probably yeah, go, go look right there. Daddy has see it right there, my babies. See, everybody you know I'm obsessed with all the birds, all animals, but here it's just like, I don't know. What I'm trying to say is that we love it here and we don't want to leave, so we're probably just going to go home tonight. You okay? We're probably just going to go home tonight and grab that stuff, sleep at home, and then come back tomorrow morning. Um, so when we go home, I'll do like laundry and that kind of stuff, but we still want to spend the day here. So anyway. I'm back inside now to try to finish talking. All that being said, we're doing a day in the life today. We're just gonna kind of wing it. First step is I got all the, that's my camera falling down. This is what it's like having four kids. Okay, take 567. We're doing a day in the life today, going to wing it. First stop is breakfast. Right now somebody is here doing the backsplash in the kitchen. I can't wait to show you everything. It's just all so exciting, but we're kind of just like have to we wing it two, a little bit more than we originally two, planned to. Tana, we catch two baby shrimp. Aww. And um, we saw like a bunch of baby ducks. They were so cute. I know. I thought I also have to I'll insert some footage of my swans here too that I'm obsessed with. I actually went and got special food for them on Amazon and a bird feeder, so maybe I can set that up later if it doesn't rain. But this weather it does look kind of sketch. Those babies were so cute. They really are. Alright, let's go eat because he's Yeah, I'm starving. Let's, let's go, go eat. eat. Get Today's video is also going to be sponsored by IXL, so I'm going to get into that a little bit later. Um, my room and like just everything is still a mess right now. It's not our normal routine yet, but once we get on a legitimate routine here, I will be so happy to film a morning routine. Um, I feel like I didn't even get to like fully update you on everything that's going on because my kids are just like not letting me speak, which is fine. We're going to get breakfast first, but I do have like a bunch of like home um, updates as to what's going on here. So. We'll get into that a little bit later, but first, let's go eat. Let's go feed these children.
All right, so, so we've got to this little diner that we've never been to before, and we're supposed to go to the bay. They do like this thing where it's kind of like where they pull up different creatures from the bay to like teach the kids about it. But um, it's starting to drizzle right now, and it doesn't look too promising outside. But trying out a new place, see how we like it. We're so weird when we try out new places. It's very like nostalgic. Like it's it's beachy. I like it. Yeah, you like it. It's got the old style Mommy! windows and everything. It's cool. Are you ketchup on eggs and home fries or no? Also, it's yeah. like they have gluten free toast here, which is nice. Yummy. You like it? <laughs> yeah? <gasps> wow, Ella. That looks amazing. I didn't make it like this. I just look like this. It's beautiful. No more. Tanner, how's yours, my bacon boy? Carter, yours looks amazing. I'm jealous of yours. French toast with fresh strawberries. Super jelly. How's yours, Christensen? Turkey sauce is really good. Try it. Yeah. I don't have any. No, I'm good. <laughs> Breakfast was was really good. That was our first time at like this new diner. Well, it's an old diner, but new owners, and our first time there. Um, the kids were really good, which makes it really nice when they're not crazy. We did have a couple spills, but just like normal kid things. Um, but it cleared up, so we're at the bay now. I'll tell you more about it once I'm done because I forget who runs it. We've only caught it a couple of times on vacation and now we're kind of figuring out what days are here. But um, they basically like will take like a big net out and catch different things and keep whatever they catch in water and teach the kids about each type of um, like each type of species that they find. I don't know. It sounds weird. But like la the last time we were here they caught like a baby seahorse and like all this stuff and they just they are so knowledgeable and I learn something every time too and it's really fun for the kids to get to just like experience it and learn new things. So anyway, it's still, it is a little chilly, a little windy, um, but we're gonna go check it out. super cute again super educational and just like good for the kids it is like a foundation that um, you can like scan little barcode and donate to like help preserve everything cool there's the doggies um but to go back to the house I think we're just gonna use the bathroom and head back home um, but I'm gonna give you a sneak peek it looks so good right um at the backsplash it looks amazing really was perfect timing because we we're just getting ready to leave and our chairs got delivered they were supposed to be here yesterday and I didn't think they were going to come I didn't know what's going on but these are for the island so hopefully they work why do they look it looks small do I have to build them hopefully we took a chair out and it's the right height all right so we just got home um, we only had to do one stop for the dogs to go to the bathroom because Chapel gets car sick. And no matter what I do, I even got him like little treats that have melatonin and some other stuff to help with car sickness. He still pukes. And so we found that like stopping halfway and giving him like some time to walk around helps him. So we did that. But otherwise, the kids were amazing in the car thanks to IXL. So our rule is if you want to go on your iPad and watch YouTube kids or play games and stuff like that, you have to do a learning activity first. And we love IXL for that. So if you don't know what IXL is, it's personalized learning with a comprehensive K-12 through curriculum 
which we love because we have learners from ages two to eight, so it works out perfectly. There's something for each of my kids that they love, and it's just a lot of fun for them. Covers plenty of topics and is just all around amazing for every learner. Something that stood out to me about IXL was that it's trusted by all top 100 U.S. school districts and used by over 13 million students, and I love that they had my state standards on their app and on the website. So one of Carter's personal goals over the summer was that he wanted to really work on multiplication before going into third grade. So this has been amazing for that. They also have, like I said, K through 12. So Everly is on it. Ella, Tanner, they're all able to be on it, which is really nice as well. How IXL is personalized so that it meets my child exactly where they're at, which helps boost their confidence, but also challenges them at the same time, but at their speed and on their level. It's also instructional and they have bite-sized video tutorials and lessons, example problems, detailed explanations, and they're all easily accessible so learners can master new concepts or reinforce their skills. Especially like over summer, I am just worried that it's easy for us parents to get off track too. You know, they don't have homework. It's easy to be like, oh yeah, let's stay up and watch a movie instead of reading. Just little things like that. So I'm happy that this just helps us keep us on track for summer and the kids love it. It's also playful and engaging. It keeps learners motivated with games and target key math and ELA concepts, plus awards and certificates help learners celebrate their milestones. I also like that it's made for every learning style. I personally am like a very like visualized, like hands-on learner and some of my kids are the same way. Some of them are more like listening auditory learners and this is great for that as well. So if you're like me and you're concerned about your kids learning and especially over the summer right now, it's where it's easy to get off track, be sure to check out IXL. I have everything linked down in the description along with a 20% off code, which is an amazing deal. My kids love this. I love it because I get to see their progress and everything like that. And I love that every single one of my kids can do this. So again, I'll have everything linked down in the description box below. Now it's time for me to do 500 loads of laundry. Um, we are, we got an update that we are supposed to have our appliances delivered on Thursday. I'm not sure like when everything's gonna be hooked up, but I'm hopeful that at the bay we'll have everything like up and running by this weekend. We also have Scarlett's birthday party here at this house on Saturday, so that's gonna be lots of fun. She's having a frozen fourth birthday. If you don't know who Scarlett is, that's my niece. Um, so lots of fun stuff. Okay, just kidding, Chris started the laundry. Um, obviously we still have a lot more to go. Plus, um, I, think, I think he has the blankets in here from the bay house. Um, our ride home, I um, ordered some things from Whole Foods because I figured we need dinner tonight and then also I can just go ahead and wash and prep produce and bring it to the Bay House tomorrow. If we do go back tomorrow, I think that's the plan unless it's like pouring down rain, maybe, maybe we won't. I'm just gonna quickly insert what we got from Whole Foods right here and then I think I'm gonna go and get started on dinner. Um, what time is it? I was editing my video a little bit. It is 5.40, so it's a good time. Um, the kids got like a little bit freaked out because it started like storming here like crazy and then I looked at our Vivint camera at the Bay and it was like perfectly sunny and beautiful there but water started like pouring in through our um, the window above our door. It's like very high up and I guess they just assumed it would flood our entire house, which obviously it wouldn't, but I had to comfort them from the storm and we're good now. Awesome. I'm, I'm making a stir fry for dinner. I think I forgot to mention that. Gotta get out my big boy for this one. Do you think the kids will actually eat this? We'll see. easy these are already shredded up I'm gonna also cut up some zucchini and like some larger broccoli cut up chicken I got easy rice and then um, this is my first time trying this so I hope it's yummy Over there. Did you see mommy using those gloves? Yeah. They're way too big, right? Okay, I'm gonna cut up vegetables now. Chef is here. 
I'm all done cutting meat, but if you want to wear gloves, that's fine. They're all nice and bathed, by the way. Mama, Mommy, want to put it on me? You want to put it on you? Yeah. Please? will cook really fast and be like too cooked and the other pieces will be cooked slower. 
So we try to make them the same size so that they cook at the same rate. Oh. Uh, like that. Smart, so find the middle. Good job. And I'm going one. for the middle. Mm -hmm. Like yep. this. Yep. Good. And then now the smaller pieces. Right? Now we gotta hold it with one hand. Like, like okay, hold, hold your zucchini. Know. So we're gonna rinse them off. Okay. Go ahead, you can go rinse them off. Sure. Okay. Go ahead, you can go rinse them off. Working on? It's for the end of the vlog. For the end of the vlog? Yeah, okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Alright, Tanner wants to turn. If you guys are making dinner, that means you're going to eat it, right? What? If you're making it, that means you're going to eat it, right? I'm definitely going to eat some of the chicken. It smells so good. And veggies, right? Yeah. yeah. The well, veggies are kind of the best part. Wait, why do I smell garlic? Um, um, it's just a seasoning, honey. <laughs> uh, <laughs> All right, let's pour it in. Uh, not tonight, but how about tomorrow night? We do like a pasta night with yeah. garlic bread. Sound good? Yeah. We're skipping this because it expired a week ago. I'm glad I decided to check that, but carrots are fresh. I just got these today. Nice job, guys. We set the table. Wait, what did I do? Okay. So here is the YouTube button and uh, wait, what? where's the bell? Ella? Yeah, like oh, and yeah, here's the bell and uh, here's the thumbs up. Just oh, give a thumbs up. Yeah, give a big thumbs up. Giant. <laughs> Never go.
We are. Oh, you got a thumbs up too? I love yeah, how she does that with her finger. Leave that on the video like I said. Leave that in the video like you said. Oh yeah, Ella drew this picture too. What does it mean, Ella? She taped it here for well, us to yeah, see. Look. Oh, you drew a little chef? Yeah, hi, she. I love it. Hi, she, Mom. Yeah. Can I tell you what it says? Well, here, yeah, here. Tell us what it says. It tell says. you what it says, vlog. Always be a chef. Always be a chef? I love that, honey. And you have a blue heart, and this is the big dishy dish yet. I love it, honey. It's so beautiful. Good job, my oh, little artist. I love the fact that I was just like you when I was in pre-K, and yeah, I drew yeah. like that. I drew the fish and 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 the Alright, so dinner was amazing. Got the kids down. I showered. I got carried away watching, what is this guy? Matt Reif on um, Instagram, just cracking up. Um, but he's really funny, you should check him out. Babe, who was the first guy we were watching? We were watching like one comedian and it led to another comedian, but anyway. What? John B. Christ or Chris? John Christ? I don't know. Just something that suggests to us when we were just sitting there laughing at a bunch of their videos. But here's some blow drying motivation for you guys because I've been so bad with blow drying my hair and it feels like such a huge task. I dried it with like, I had like a hair, like towel wrap on for a bit. Um, so at least it's like, it's mostly dry, but especially with like one row of extensions, it takes even longer. So anyway, let's try this. Lights out, heart beating faster in a minute. I'm high on slow dancing with you. One, two, three, keep it going, last forever. All blacked out, then flying with you. I don't care that my mind's gone insane. And my okay, Paul, then this is how you what Krisha said. So, what did you. He, Chris has been switching the laundry. Chris does the most laundry in the house. I always tell you guys that because he's amazing. He worked at Apple Robert when he was younger. He's an amazing folder, but he was just laughing because he found a bunch of rocks in the dryer. And whenever we go to the bay, there's like not like a ton of shells. So Eddie's always collecting rocks, especially if she has pockets. So like we never know. No, I think it's from our backyard. From our backyard? Yeah, at, at the bay. Oh, oh, but at the bay, yeah. But at, today at the bay, she was, like when we did the fishing thing, she was handing me rocks too. Anyway, she's an avid rock collector. Now we need to check her pockets. <laughs> so cute. like at the time on the camera and that was 10 minutes so that's the way to go mostly air dry and then blow dry but anyway I'm gonna end it here go relax and spend some time with Chris it's like 10 o'clock it's been so hard to get my kids to bed on time since summer break started I feel like I'm not getting out of the rooms until like 9 30 or so so not as much me time as I would like but it is all good I love spending time with them but I need to start going to bed earlier when I don't have me time. I still wind up staying up until like 11.30 to like watch something or, you know, just scroll and watch um, like funny things, lighthearted things, or um, I don't really want to get back into reading. But for me, like once I'm out of it, it's so hard to get back into it. So I need to get back, ooh, back into my book. Um, so yeah, I was reading like, I don't remember what it's called, one of the Lucy Score books and I'm on like, the second one of the series and I literally can't even remember what it's called. Anyway, hopefully we get back into reading because it does help me sleep better. But I hope that you all enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe, give this video a thumbs up. You're probably gonna be seeing a lot more day in the life videos. You know, Chris always vlogs on his channel, Peace and Family Vibes, but more from my perspective, just because I plan on having like a fun filled summer with the kids and just taking you along the way. So I today when you're seeing this, it is Sunday, so I will see you on Tuesday.